What's up guys, it's Daz here. But you don't really care as I got that gem off screen and now we're going to B5, that dog the key hog. A very risky spectral pooch took the special key that we need. Track the dog down and get that key back. Well Luigi, I've got good news and bad news. The good news is that the ghost dog that took the special key is still somewhere in the haunted towers. The bad news is that the dog is running from room to room, so we can't actually pinpoint him. However, the periscope discovered something that may help us. Our little pup left behind a trail of spectral paw prints starting in the courtyard. If you follow that invisible trail, you should eventually find him. The prints will be visible to the naked eye. They w the prints will be? The prints will be visible. oh, invisible! to the naked eye, so you'll need to use the dark light device to reveal them. <laughs> Ready? Luigi, don't you dare come here without that special key. Haha, -ha, you should have seen the face on your face, Sunny. Ha, priceless. I got distracted because I just realized that they call it the stro- No, they don't. I was gonna say they call it the stro bulb in the thing. I got distracted. Couldn't say that right because I got distracted. Was that the same opening cutscene as last time? I don't remember. Anyway, we need to find the ghostly dog. I found it. It's over here in the courtyard. So you may notice it left a little mark in the wall, even though this has probably been pointed out before, but if not, the dog leaves a mark for every time it goes through a wall, it leaves a mark, basically. Like here, you can see, it ran in there, so we have to go and basically chase after this dog for the better part of 10 minutes, which is fair enough. But it's also kind of good, because it takes us to this room, the tool shed, which, first of all, where's the dog? Hasn't left? Wait, there we go. These footprints are throwing me off. There it is. Alright, so now it's left. You can see it through there, but remember this tool shed. It'll be important in a minute. So, where did it go? Not in there, is it? Whoa, where is this thing going? Oh no, it's over there! Am I blind? I might be blind. Who pulled that lawnmower back anyway? Hold on, I want the key. I want. I want the monies. Also, there's a, a... Hmm. I wonder if that's supposed to be like Lydia from the first game. It reminds me of it. Anyway, the dogs now run along uh, to the staircase back. Can we even see it in there? I hope so. Yeah, there it is. Hmm. Well, I know just how to get it, but not quite, because there's a bunch of sneakers in your way. Thankfully, if you're as quick as me and you can do this, they ain't gonna be a problem. And that's really satisfying, so thank you. Also, I like how the lightning shows off any sort of invisible things. It's helpful. But anyway, remember that tool shed I was talking about just earlier? Everything's gone. All of it. So, we're gonna go find everything. We're gonna bring it all back. Oh, only one spherical? Interesting design. That's more like it. Doing that gets us our boo of the mission. <gasps> yip yip, I'm a French boodle, aren't I a bootiful? I swear another boo said that in the first game, aren't I bootiful? So, you're just a rip off. Speaking of ripping off, I'm gonna rip off your tongue. Thank you. Alright, and that's our boo of the mission. So now, let's just go and I left that coin, I can see it just behind the desk, but oh well. Let's go and get to our little dog friend, shall we? That key hog of a dog. Also, I said this last episode, but in case you didn't watch it, the name of this mission is different in the American version. They just call it Dalgon Key instead of the dog, that key hog. Jesus, what a horrible scream. Now then. You'll see that we've got a staircase, we've got to chase the dog up, blah blah blah, we've used to this all before. But there is another opportunity for a collectible here. 
It's in a hidden drawer like this, but it's not that one because it's not hidden. You've gone, oh, you went up. Oh, I have to go the long way. Boring. Actually, it's not too bad because I've already unlocked the place, so I guess it's not too boring, but still, make me run into two rooms I don't really need to run into. Just because the place fell apart, I have to take a detour. In the Tower of Detours. There we go. Hello. You. Oh, I just went in there, dog. Come on. That was not quite what I was... Whoa, that bad is glitched. Huh. The animation was all wrong. Is that the thing? No, it's not. There it is. Gone greeny. Not hidden, but in a desk. Oh my god, this bat. I swear to god. Now I want all the money possible, so I'm going to do a full A pool tug on it. Oh no! I want it... Oh, okay. Well, it's good it went here, because... If I did the thing over there, it would have dropped all the gold bars. Wow. Well, it wouldn't mean too big of an issue. I only would have missed the gold bars, and I missed the gold bars anyway, because I didn't tug on it. No. Oh, whatever. Dog's in here. That is, no, that's the gem over there I'm looking at. I was going to say, is that it over there? But no. It's in here, yes. Unless it... Wait. Which way are those paws going? They are going down, right? Oh, spiders, get out of here. I know. Yeah, it's gone this way. Fair enough, is it going? Seriously, it's like on the roof. Um, hold on. I can find it. Okay, yeah, all of that and it just went up. Okay. Thank you for wasting my time, game, but hey, it's how the game loves to play sometimes. And we got all the collectibles in this mission, because all there is is a boo and a gold greenie. Seriously, why call it a gold greenie? Call it a goldie. Right, welcome to the conservatory. I'm gonna guess it's in the... Wait a minute. The organ's missing. Probably be a good idea if I got it, don't you think? And you too. Now, are you in here? So you'll see it's hiding around one side. What you wanna do is not do that. I think you gotta lure it out? I remember this, but I can't remember what you do. You should technically be able to flash it from there, really. How about I just land right on top of you with the floating berry? There you go. It's one weird puzzle game. Like, really? That's so weird. No choice. Oh, great. Another creeper. Hold on. Thank you. I'm not even gonna... Actually, I probably should kill you. There we go. Get in here. Alright, now we got the happier music. Thank goodness. Actually, maybe you weren't supposed to float. You could have just went around and around, but oh well. Ah, I just want to move. Why are you delaying me more? I'm just after a damn dog. Or a dog on dog, technically. And I can't get anywhere because this gob is really... Oh my god, I flashed you, greeners. Greenies. Okay, hold on. You get... Oh, I'll suck you anyway, just because you're out of the way of everyone else. Here. You two now. Thank you. Get in here. Get in here. Stop wasting my time. Give me health. Gobba, stop. And... Damn it. Oh, I dodged it? No, I got her. Oh, I don't know what's going on anymore. I was pulling you. Ah. So, uh, I wanted to say this not until after I'd already finished the mansion, but this is my least favourite mansion. I don't know, this is just... The amount of detours, the wasting time, the fact that everything feels like filler. By the way, the dog went in there. It just... Ugh, ugh, ugh. And also, on another negative note, the Gloomy Man is my second least favourite mansion. Yay. But anyway, I finally found the dog. He's pretty much cornered in the toilet. Can I get it yet? Of course I can't. This is basically just a tour around the mansion in case you hadn't, you know, known the design yet. I guess. And then it also just delays you more with more enemies, but at least it's like using them a bit. There we go, perfect. That's exactly how I wanted that to play out. Alright, West Bedroom, what have you got for me? Where'd you go? Uh, what? Did I even... What did I do? I don't even know what I did there. Okay. 
Anyway, now is your opportunity to actually grab the thing. He will keep running back and forth between two rooms at this point, so suck him up now, because that's your only opportunity. So the opportunity stays around forever. Now finally, after like three missions of detours, we've got the special key. And guess what happens now? Yoddy Gad. Hello. And guess what he says? Huzzah! You finally nabbed the special key! Good work catching that dog, Luigi! You know, I think the little guy just wanted someone to play with. Well, he'll find plenty of playmates in the vault. I'll bring you back down now, son. Hold on. Ciao. Okay, we're done now. Just ten minutes, literally ten minutes of chasing a dog and killing some ghosts on the side. Oh well, we got all the collectibles, we got all the gems, all the booze, blue, 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 and we got three stars, so that's always a plus. Yeah! Yeah! Let's get moving. Welcome back, Luigi! Let's send that pot pup down to the vault right away! Yes, um, good idea. Let's do this. That's not the pot pup. That's also not the pot pup. That's the treasure, but, you know, you do you, game, and I'll do me. the same, Luigi. Ugh. Cramity, how did it escape from the Poltergeist 5000? I guess I'll have to tighten up the containment unit. But that can wait. Let's see that special key. Yep, there's a ghost out on the loose again, but we'll get the key. Well, I guess the priorities are sort of right. Gah, it's all chewed up and slimy. I'll ask the Toad Fellow to give it a good clean before I try to repair it. Yes, the timing of this will work out perfectly. You see, I've just finished my analysis of the spectrogenetic paracomposition of the Dark Moon pieces we have. How did I mess up the sentence before the two long words? Oh, uh, sorry. How do I put this? Luigi, I basically asked our Dark Moon pieces where their friend is hiding. And once I enter the data into the periscope, we'll know exactly where the next Dark Moon piece is. Well, great. Basically, we know where it is now. So, go get it using your special key. So next time, we're gonna do some tree topping? We're gonna find the boss of the Haunted Towers. Then we're gonna be done, and then we're moving on. That's just the way the game goes. I'm glad. We're good. Okay. For now, my name's been Daz. Um, this is a complete wrong tone of voice. I'll go with it anyway. You don't really care. And I'll see you in a bit. Well, seriously, what sort of tone of voice was that? I have no idea what I'm doing anymore.